What's going on guys, Cobert here, and welcome back once again to my Stoneheart Let's Play. I say that differently every time, it's like six different words, I max them up, mix them up every single time. Can't even say mix them up right, right now. Man, the rust is still strong. Uh, we are right back, right back from where I left you before. We are about to hit up and do Zai. Zai is going to be our new trapper. We gotta get her out there, we gotta get her collecting leather. That is the prerequisite to and before i forget oh she's got to hit the thing okay and so before i we get a leather worker we need leather right i mean that that's kind of makes very good sense to me so once she gets her little tool so we got two soldiers we've got a bunch of other utility people we've got one worker which isn't great but we don't have any really big projects we're just not really excuse me we're not going to be able to make anything too crazy uh from the get-go so I'm just kind of putting these things around. I don't know if, is, is there any, like, rhyme or reason to this? Like, I kind of generally go the more the merrier. <laughs> but that might not be a good strategy. So if anybody knows, I kind of try to keep them relatively close. Uh, again, I, I, I really honestly don't know if this is how you should be doing it. I just kind of do a various couple different spots. She seems to do okay. And that's, that's just what we do. So, let's see here. We've got her. So, he, he can make this. This this is what pisses me off. I, I Wait. No, that, that's not correct. Again, I clicked on something it didn't take. I, I need, either need to buy a bolt of leather or harvest it. I can make it myself somehow. Uh, man, makes me so upset because I could have this. I don't need two of these. One is good. Um, yes, yeah, so we need... All right, so did we not harvest this stuff? We can harvest it again, though, can't we? Indeed, we can. But we only have one worker, so it might take a little while. We have that stuff, too. But, the, yeah, this is the stuff. What am I out of, actually? Ah, oh, sorry, guys. I, I used to escape being the key. You hit the back out of mirror. Uh, menus. I am out of the herbs. The herbs. Not the fiber, ironically enough. Okay, cool. Because I can grow the herbs. The herbs. And why do I keep saying herbs? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, so that filled in. That's not bad. Actually, that's the right color there. That's not too bad. So, okay. So there we go. So we can tell him to harvest this now. All the way down. We can tell him to grab this all the way down. That all the way down. We, have the, we basically have the template now, so... And I'm hoping I can just sneak some clay out of here. That, that's basically the hope. And then what's going to happen is I'm going to put the wall at the top. That's kind of going to be the look of our hill, if you will. Okay, so we're going to have to keep an eye on leather. We can look in here, can't we? It should show us content. So what do we got in here? We don't... I'm just wondering if there maybe somebody gave us leather. So we've got a blacksmith hammer... Spoon. I don't have anybody bitching about, you know, food and stuff, so. Let's see right now. Let's, can we? Yeah, we need, I mean, we need. It's not going to show me the job. I can't, I can't get rid of the, the worker, though. This is another thing I, I just kind of started to set up quickly. I'm going to try a little stairs. So we're going to have him. The idea is to go down. Uh, I'm theorizing that uh, deeper will be better stuff. Yes, yes. Not enough net worth. That's kind of crazy to me. Wait, where the heck? Um, oh, there we go. Because I feel like I feel like I've got like I've harvested good stuff way sooner than I normally do. Like this is a silver vein right here. But what's weird is like I don't want to hire. I don't hire. I don't want to harvest too much because I feel like. You know, I'm just thinking right now. What I was gonna say is I don't want to harvest too quickly because I mean my my what what attacks me is absolutely governed by how much wealth I have. And while I want wealth, obviously, I don't want too much of it. Copper. That's a hunk of stone with stuff in it. Really? That's kind of disheartening. These guys are going to chop that out. That's fine. 
Because, yeah, once we get down here, then what I'll do is I'll, then I'm going to go ham and like just kind of branch mine. Put some lights around. We've got decent little tunnels and stuff. We've got little quick workshops. These guys are harvesting that. That's good. Okay. All right, let's, let's turn this up again. I promise you guys I would keep doing this and fast forward. Now, some of these projects are going to drag now because I have just the one worker. But, I mean, that's kind of what it is. Um, okay. She, is she doing something? Let's see. Where is she? All right. So, actually, yeah. She's probably just going around putting her traps out. So, it's going to take a little while before she starts harvesting the traps. I understand that. That makes good sense to me. Yeah, we've got all kinds of foxes and stuff out here. Let's, let's give her a little zone out here. This looks like a, like a nice zone. I see all kinds of stuff out here. Now, I, I think that the general pitfall of sending her out here is that there's a better chance she's going to run at the bad guys. So, set up your traps, girl. I want to see these things get trapped. I want to actually see... Wait, why is... I'm confused. Like, why is this one full size? This one's... Looks like something should be in this one. These, these look like they're down, and then they clamp over. Is there an actual animation for that? Is she not? She's gonna run away and arm other traps? Wow, okay. Oh, bunny rabbit. Then her bunny rabbit disappears. I don't know if there's actually... I'm probably by watching this right now, I'm kind of keeping them from getting trapped. Oh, yeah, she goes, she's got a wolf, fox, whatever. Got one. It's all right, get us that leather. What do we... I don't even know what we need. Let's see, can we even look at the things we need? No, it won't even let us look. Like, I've never actually... I keep meaning to look at Engineer. Have some leather, have some leather, have some leather. Nah, see, they don't, they don't sell leather. All right. Um, wealth. Actually, I could sell things, right? Like, I could... That's a good way to enhance our wealth. Sell it all. Sell you all. That's actually pretty good money for that. All right, we're going to do... We're going to keep making those, I think. Those are pretty good for those, too. Stone wall. That's one of those. That's one stone, right? That's actually pretty good, too. Eight gold for one stone, basically. Yeah, we're going to keep making lanterns, I think. Yeah, we're going to keep making lanterns. That, that seemed like good money. And it, it's probably good uh, XP for them, too. Yeah, it's only one stone. So we're going to have them make, like, 20 of those. We shouldn't have any problem with stone. This is the same thing. It's only one, but it doesn't, uh, it doesn't return as much. So there you go. We're on that. What are you doing, sir? Oh, you sh should be... There's one clay for... So that's three clay. So these are actually... That was a pretty good return on those two. We'll make like ten of those. I wasn't even thinking about the gold as a quick way to raise... Raise our value. Now this guy... I don't want to use too much clay, because while clay is plentiful, I will burn through clay quickly as I start to build buildings. So... Uh... Yeah, I was just going to say I can make some bricks, but bricks aren't really going to give me any money or wealth back. Wow, this is actually a lot of... This is a lot of flowers over here I can harvest, but actually I shouldn't need them. Mason level 4, that's actually pretty good. Oh, what do we got? Let's take a look. Alright, so just stone things again. These guys are pretty easy mode. Let's see what happens here. Control these guys. Yeah, there we go. 
I think we should probably be taking the step up to wolves pretty soon. And wolves aren't that much harder. They will inflict more damage, but I actually have the means to to heal up now, so that won't be so bad. But then, like I said, the one time I got a... See, he's coming to heal him. Perfect. There should be some stuff in here. No, there's nothing in here. Why is there nothing in here? Oh, because I didn't tell it to take it out of here. Yep, 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 yep. Take that out. I think that's it, right? Eventually, I'll move wealth and stuff out of there, too. I'll move everything out of the stockpile for the most part. I think uh, one of the buildings, maybe like right in here, will do a big custom. Um, no, you know, that might be part of the keep then. We'll do the keep and like a big uh, central. I'm trying to think of a word. It's escaping me right now. But the, the fortification will be just a giant warehouse for things like weapons, armor, wealth, that kind of stuff. And then out here, maybe we'll do a big, giant custom warehouse for things like, you know, the resources, tools, things that the peasants can can play with, in essence. All right, let's just, I'm just going to keep moving these stairs down one layer at a time. See how far we get. Like, how low can you go? All right. All right, we'll just do that guy. We'll see when we can mesh up with him. That might make our pathfinding just go crazy. What are you guys doing? What up? What up, guys? Oh, wait. Go. Go on patrol. All right, so we got the weaver. We do have a blacksmith. I just don't have the people for it. <laughs> that kind of stinks. We're pretty close. Oh. oh. Was that today? That was today. Shoot, I didn't even see that. I said everything but the value. Are you serious? Uh, there's actually quite a bit of... Why is nobody digging this out? Oh, I know why, because I only have the one worker. This is kind of stink. It gets to be stinking now. It gets to be stinking now. We're going to take that out. I don't like that. How are we doing? That's not food. Food is over here. Uh, I got some food. Okay. Yo, Helm's Dirt. I'm just passing through, but I'd be willing to make a trade or two. If you're interested in making six clay beds, I'll be back in two days. One wooden sword. Uh... I don't know if that's necessary, is it? Oh, that's not what I want. I, I just want to see. All right, I'll do it. Because clay bed, six clay beds is just six clay. That's an abundant resources that I have. So, yeah, I'll do it. And I'll just do it. It'll give, it'll give the potter some XP. I am going to have to think about finding some clay, though. That's going to be a thing. It's a little crazy. Because every other world I've ever played, clay was like... I mean, it was a form of currency. Like, it was just so abundant. But that's how it goes, I suppose. Every little world has its own wrinkle to it. Is this guy really growing in the middle there? No, that's not the one that shoot. Okay. So we got here. Oh boy. Oh, I thought that was a big, big guy. All right, now, the two of these, that's, that's nothing crazy. I think we can handle this. The only, the only issue is because of the way my, the way my town is designed. 
It's, these guys are pretty far away. So I hope the soldiers can get there in time. Now, nah, see, I'm, I'm thinking the villagers are going to take some damage here. Unless they run right past them. All right, get in there. I think friendly fire is not on. Uh, yeah, see, I wasn't that wasn't that great. Just because of the fact that my soldiers had to run so far away. Like they're patrolling, I get that. But I'm wondering if there's some some better way to do this. Trying to organize this up. Wait. That... Just not not exactly the smartest moving right now. I think that's it. I don't know. Is that right? Should be. Ah. I can gather it all. There we go. It's good resources right there. It's like a whole other farm field, basically. Alright, those guys are all going to sleep. Good. The herbalist, hopefully. Let's see, let's see where we're at on those. Like, he... Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to like move him up anymore. Man, I need a person right now, so bad. I don't want to work the herbalist that much because I basically want him to. He's gonna be moving up the cleric, so there's no real sense in burning resources on his XP. Is that right? That is right. Hold on a second. All right. Let's get that moving. Get those built. <sighs> so let's just for the for the sake of it, we can see here. I have. Leather working and I have blacksmithing, which I really want to do. I think right now cleric is actually more important because I don't even have a lot of like resources like ores and stuff to work with. I do need to start stockpiling that. And frankly, I should start like putting like I should really I'm just gonna like put this here. Let's say we've got a couple of these. Make those all two of them ores or three of them ores. And then like the last one. Yeah, I'll make like three of them ores, one that. And then so we're ready to go. This way if they're down in the, the mine here, they just walk here and they dump. They don't have to walk all the way down here. Speed that up a little bit. What is that? Fox jerky. Okay, do we have leather? We have some squirrel pelt. Okay. I just need to get another person, basically. <laughs> and then he, we are going to have the weaver. You are pretty much full. You are not quite full. Okay. I mean, I'm about to just to start digging into this dirt at some point. Just to get some clay rolling in. She's, that's good. These things are all flowers. That's going to be some good medicine. So when I do upgrade the cleric, I don't even know if I'd bother with another. I'm not going to bother with another uh, herbalist for a little while. Let's see what the cleric can do. I believe someone told me that the far, the cook actually will help with farming, which is great. Aleph Sharak. Which got about 334. That's actually pretty good. 
that's a just a good all around guy. Good, just good dude. Three, three, four, four, three, six. Now Leah Dona is more like a. Uh, she's like an like a soldier or archer or something. This guy's actually pretty good too, though. Uh, yeah, we're just doing a trapper. I don't think a trapper needs to. Oh no, this is a weaver. I can't. I can't waste that spirit though. I can't waste it on a a non combat person. That'd be crazy. So there you go, guys. We got our weaver. There she goes right there. Oops, sorry. So there we go. We got the weaver. We are going to make the loom. Spinning wheel. Weaver bench. And that will be where we leave off this episode. Next time, we're going to place that down. We're going to start making some, hopefully, a bolt of leather. I hope. I hope. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I, I could be totally wrong. Maybe, the, maybe the, he doesn't leather work. No, there we go. Right here. Bolt of leather. What do I need? I need a spinning whatever the hell. We got that. We got enough of this. We, we should be able to get this. We should be able to do this next episode. We're going to get the cleric. We're going to have our little pocket healer for our two infantry guys. And then what we're going to do is we're going to obviously try to get some more people in. We're going to then slide into blacksmithy, trying to make some weapons, armor, that kind of stuff. But thank you so much for watching, guys. Let me know what you think down in the comments, which way you'd like to see me go. More militant, more trader. Because there's a point where I have to choose uh, what kind of a city I want to be. So let me know ahead of time. What you guys are feeling, what you, what you want to see me pursue. Uh, basically, I'm just going to pursue survival. But uh, for now, we've survived three days, three episodes. Is that what this was? I told you I'd forget. I feel like at the end of three or end of four, I've already forgotten. I don't know. That's pretty typical me. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care.